Hey there everyone, welcome back to another episode of Pacific Drive. As always, I'm Captain Beefy and this is the Game Vault and we're about to head out on another run. Uh, but first, the fax machine is beeping. So yeah, let's cue the music and then we'll see what this is about. So this is what I was hoping we would do is get some weird messages out of here and maybe uh, learn something. The roads will take you home, Henry. The roads will take you home. Listen to me. You know, this place mixes everything up. You see how it doesn't mix up the roads? That's the key. Forget about where the buildings, the trees, the landmarks are. Stick to the roads. Okay, well, that's not very helpful, but hey, whatever. It is what it is, right? Still haven't figured out what to do with this thing. Um, but yeah. All right, well, the car is in good shape, for the most part. Uh, let's check our inventory here. Yeah, we got two of those, one of those, one of those, three, three, one. whole bunch of food, whole bunch of flares. Gasoline, just in case. We haven't run into the opportunity where we need it yet, but we got it. Now, as far as these things go, I almost, I kind of want to build another impact hammer. And, um, yeah, one of these two. I think that would be a huge help. Go ahead and put that there for now. Yeah, we're still good on these. We've got, we've had these forever. I haven't had to make any for a while. So, yeah, well, let's build an impact hammer and a scrapper just so we have some backups out there. Okay. And you know what? Before we head out, <clears throat> we're going to be smart this time. And we're going to equip everything and put it into its proper slots. Including some flares. And some food. Alright, so... This one for some reason doesn't like to stick, but everything else is okay. Good. Alright, so our plan route today that we plotted is to here, right? So the first stop is going to be here, I guess, to G8 and then G7 and then up there. I don't know. Let's see what happens when we go over there. Oh, and also, yeah, I forgot we got this Tinker Station. There's only two problems right now, and neither one of them seems to be really impacting me, so I'm not worried about them too much. Alright, let's start up this car and get on the road. Fortunately, it's daylight. Hopefully we won't lose daylight on this trip. But we shall see, right? We're going to try and blast through the first uh, areas, and Hopefully we'll be able to get right to that third area, which is the uh, ultimate destination for us. And now it's, well, yeah, that's the ultimate destination, but we're not going to be able to get there this time. But hopefully we can get there. All right. Let's move on. We're going to try and get through this without much uh, aggravation. We're not going to explore anything like that. We're just going to zip through. See what we can find. I think once we get past this wall, we're going to be able to maybe, um, yeah, there's our exit that we want. I think maybe we're going to be able to get some unstable energy and then corrupted energy in the last part to get some of those more advanced tools and whatnot. So that's what I'm looking forward to right now. I think we're going to be on this for a while, though, I think. And I do like I changed uh, POV to 10, 110 last time. And I'm really digging that. I think it's uh, definitely a worthwhile change. Come on through, buddy. There you go. 
yeah, I think that was a good change. And we're not going to switch it back by any stretch of the imagination, that's for sure. Alright, so we got a long way to go on this, but hopefully we won't run into any trouble. I hear some stuff going on, but it's okay. Yeah, I was looking through and checking out some of the things we can build and all that, and there's some neat stuff in there. I just kind of been tooling around, going in and out, taking it easy, taking it slow, and I really want to make some advances now, so that's where we stand. We're going to make a right when we hit the crossroads up here. coming up to that pretty soon. Yep. We're getting there. No, you go away, buddy. Stay away from me. Alright, yeah, here's our right. And I don't know if this leads to a tunnel or something. It looks like it might lead to a tunnel or something like that, but we're going to go right through that. And it should take us right out. So, we're doing great on our uh, battery power. That's not a problem. Fuel's not bad. And we got plenty of fuel. I got the little fuel can and I got a large fuel can on me. Fuel's never going to be a problem for this vehicle. We're through it. We're through it. We're good. I hate that. Yeah, it's a tunnel. I was right. Oh, what do we got? An issue with a tire, it feels like. Yeah, I can hear it. And we're going through some crap now. Great. Let's just get through this. There we go. And yay, more of this crap. Right, we're still good. We're still good. Back door's a little beat up. Ooh, what's that? Is that our gas thing? Is got an issue? I don't like that. Alright, we're here. Let's stop check things out. Off-road tire. So we're going to need to, I think, seal that, right? And what's going on with this thing? Leaking. I'm uh, not going to worry about that right now, but I think a sealing kit is going to work, maybe, for the tire. Let's see. Perfect, it did. Okay. Looks like we got another one. I bet we can fix that too. Yep, alright, good. Alright, well, I'm glad we had those. Uh, this is a little beat up. What are we looking at? Can I see through the window? It's really the only thing that's a little beat up. We could slap some. Uh, some of this goop on there real quick. There we go. Oh, no, we want the food back. Okay. Alright, so we're back in, back in good shape now. Let's go through the zone. Yeah, I did not want to be running around with a flat tire or a leaky tire, and that leaky fuel is a little bothersome, too, to be honest with you. 
Okay, so we can go here, here. Yeah, that's it. We got two choices, right? All right, let's go to G1. I was kind of hoping that uh, we wouldn't have to face any nightmarish storm in that third spot, but it looks like uh, it's still going to be there when we get there, so it's like super unstable. Which is kind of bad. I don't know. Is that going to change our uh, change our plans or what? Disruptive discharge junction. Okay. Well, let's go. So we're going to have to kind of bear left on this all the way around and then take a left when we get to that cross road area there. It's getting dark out. We've got some weather coming in. Yeah, we're not escaping without whoa, without wipers and uh, lights. That's for sure. Damn it! All right. Well, we kind of made it through that. Let's try this one. Whoa, I did not expect that to happen. Okay, that really sucked. Yeah. Alright, are we on the damn road? I can't even see it in this mess. I think it's right over here. There we go. Hey, thanks for all that, guys. Appreciate it. Like it's over this way. Yep. Oh, is the storm stopping? Good. All right. At least we can turn the wipers off for now. I don't. Th eh, we can run without the lights for a little bit. That's okay. All right. We got a ways to go here before we take a hard left. going to keep cruising. Nope, don't want that. I feel like my FOV changed again. Let me see. sure it's not in here. That's all the binding shit now. It's not in there. I just gotta slow down. We'll find it. We'll find it. Camera, brightness, player, FOV, car, FOV. No, we're right. Okay. We're back where we were. Right, here comes our turn up ahead. This 
fit here. Yep, this is it. All right, let's go on and get out of here. Man, it rain again. Just an absolute horror show here. Got that tire messed up again. But we're pretty close to the exit, so that's good. I thought we were. going through this time. And yeah, high instability, check conditions. This is not good. What are we going to do here? I don't want to waste this trip. I, we have to go here. We need two Klim for the gateway. Screw it, we're going. We should have uh, we should have gathered some of those anchors before we got here, but we're okay. We're gonna try this out, man. This could uh, result in us going back home with our tail between our legs, and that'll be fine. You know, um, we really weren't gathering stuff up on this run and all that, so if we lose some stuff, we lose some stuff. Hopefully not. But yeah, these things aren't too far out, so we might be able to just burn through here real quick. Yeah, we're getting close. We're getting close. What is that? Oh, that's kind of neat. Yeah, that's one of the anchors, but why is it red? Oh, I bet you. It's unstable. Okay. I get it now. No, no, no. What happened there? We gotta get in this car. Holy crap. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, our battery is dead, isn't it? Wow. We got a little beat up. We only need one more of those. And then we can GTFO. So, yeah, let's try this out, man. There it is. There it is. Oh, God, this is so bad. All right, try oh, the door opened again. Cool. Okay. Whoop, that's not right. Not, that's not the right door. Okay, we're in. So where do we want to go now? So there is a fairly nearby location right there. That's the one we're going to go for.
why not have any working lights? All right, good. A little bit of power there. Oh, that's not good. All right, let's go around here. Try and take it kind of easy here a little bit. Um, yeah, we're a little beat up, but we should be maybe okay. Uh, there's that other limb energy, but we really don't want that right now. I think I'm going to get back with everything pretty much intact. Yes! Well, that was exciting. <laughs> that was big time exciting. All right, well, we're home. Stuff is beat to hell, but we are home, you home, not home. Be tracking all that zone goo into my garage. You better hush, lady. Okay. Heal ourselves first. Our battery was eh, pretty low, 17%. Look at that. Car is beat to crap, though, but that's for sure. Go ahead and get that jacked up. We'll go ahead and fill up on our gas. Fill that, too. Nope. Okay. Yeah, see that? That's generating power. I mean, turbine. Alright, so we can go ahead and put these things in. Really didn't even need them that time around, did we? Let's see what we got in here. So, we got one. Go ahead and load that into here. A lead plated one up top here. Go ahead and take that off. Yeah, I know they're both pretty crappy. Wheels aren't too, too bad. This wheel's shot, but we'll, we don't even need to fix that. We're going to throw it in the thing, and it'll be fine. Pretty sure we had one headlight, if not two, in here. Might have to make another, but that's cool. We'll do that. Uh, yeah, this is the bad tire. Then we just need a bunch of doors and panels and all that fun stuff. Didn't mean to do that. There we go. Alright, you are going to get repaired. I wish this was closer to the car. Really? I didn't build another one yet, did I? No? Alright, good. Alright, I thought we had to. Ok. 
Okay. Three more doors. Oh, a bumper. Yeah, we got that front bumper. Sucks. Let's pull that off. Back bumper ain't doing much, much better, but it's okay for now. Everything else in here is being worked on. Okay. Alright, got us a new bumper. These two panels suck. So we're going to have to do a little bit of arranging in here, I think. Let's see. Can we move that to here. Yeah. We'll move this to here. Good deal. That goes into there. I guess that's about the extent of that, huh? This panel is shot. I have to go there. I got three crappy doors. Pretty crappy bumper. Fax machine's going off. Okay, don't know what that meant either. Uh, let's go back into here, see what we got. We got a radiation panel thing. So at least we could put one of these on. And I know we got like a lead, or what is this called? Armored panel. <laughs> oh, we're leaving it like that because it's so cheesy looking, that's great. So I need three doors and a bumper. Go ahead and build what we can build here. Insulated doors. I can build one. Steel door. So we can build two of those. This looks like the insulated one. Yep. So yeah, we're regressing a little bit right now. But that's okay because we're going to um, maybe just do a couple quick runs into an easy area. To give things time to heal up, right? Be the smart thing to do. We should have a tire in there too. All right. Well, 100%, 100%, 90%. 90% isn't terrible. Not great, but not terrible either. Uh, I got doors and panels and bumpers here. Oh yeah, we really want to get all this stuff fixed up. I mean, but yeah. Yeah. So if we just do a short run. Look how much this is building up. Why is that? Is it just going to get worse? I hope not. So maybe we'll go to here first. Or 
or look to go to there and it'll just force us to take a different route. One of these little easier ones that was up close. And then we can come back. But first off, we got some unstable energy and I want to check out and see what that's all about. Because we might be able to build some stuff that we weren't able to build before. And I have that feeling, oh yeah, carbon fiberglass. So I don't know what that's going to be good for, but let's take a look at the tools. A plasma scrapper. That sounds like a really good tool. This will repair on the road. That's kind of nice. Okay. What else do we have? Nothing else? That one's corrupted. This one's an advanced workbench. Oh, can we make the advanced workbench? Hold on. Where is that? Copper wire and steel sheets. Oh boy. That's so tempting. I don't think we can make copper wire though, can we? No. Is this copper wire? Yeah. Why does it say we have nine in there? Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Advanced workbench. We need ten. Oh, we got a computer to tear down. We might get some copper wire out of that. Yeah, this is definitely going to be worth checking out. Right, give me some copper wire, man. Yes! Oh, 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 oh yeah. Alright, we're good. Grab the rest of that crap for now. Yeah, we're going in, we're making that, whatever it is. Let's see. Advanced workbench, so we need four steel sheets. Let's do that. Perfect. I know we can get a ton more steel just by scrapping that car out there and all that fun stuff. Advanced workbench. Oh, we don't have enough... I was looking at the energy wrong. You gotta be. Oh, okay, never mind. Yep, yeah, feel like a jackass now. <sighs> All right, well. The fiberglass. All right, a plasma scrapper. I think we can do that. Damn. Flare. I wonder what the hell that is. Crude flashlight, okay. Plasma charger. flashlight and a bio flare you know what I think we're gonna do this blow torch for sure all right yeah let's look at making these things now so we need four plasma for that so we're gonna need to go on a plasma run uh, what was the other thing we made Blowtorch. 
I'm going to need marsh eggs. I don't know where to get marsh eggs, so that's interesting. Okay, that's kind of useless for now. Cool. But we're ready for that other thing. We're just going to have to get the unstable energy again. Which is a little frustrating, but it's okay. It's going to be okay. We'll get there. Plasma. Alright guys, so yeah, I think we're going to go ahead and wrap this one up. It's going to be a little bit shorter than the usual one. Uh, but thanks for joining me today. As always, I'm Captain Beefy with the Game Vault. We got the car in decent shape. Our goal right now is going to be to get some plasma energy and basically um, come back, make that plasma thing, get some of this stuff you know, better um, built up and all that. We're going to work on that. You know, get these things repaired here uh, by using this machine. That sort of stuff for now. And then we'll, um, you know, we'll have a better vehicle afterward. So we've only got the steel doors in a couple spots right now. So yeah, we're not in the best of shape. I mean, we're okay, but definitely leaves a, leaves a lot to be desired. So yeah, Let's wrap it up, guys. I'll see you guys next time. Don't forget to leave a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel. Ring that bell for notifications. I'll see you next time. Until then, peace.